What is going on guys and welcome back to another unboxing and first impression video here on my channel. Today I want to have a look on the TP-Link TLSG1005D 5 port gigabit switch and see how it performs compared to my old 100 Mbit switch. So let's get right into it after the intro. Alright, so let's have a quick look at the packaging. So as you can see, you can connect up to 4 devices and it should also be a pretty fast switch with up to 1000 megabits per second. So I got this switch because I upgraded my internet contract to 250 Mbit down and 50 Mbit upload and that is not possible with my old TP-Link fast Ethernet switch. So let's see what's inside the box and just open it up with my unboxing knife. Some manuals and everything is packed in plastic. Let's get the packaging aside and have a look at the switch itself. It looks decent, but it's completely made out of plastic, but that doesn't really matter as it will be under my table anyway. So here is a close up what you get. Basically it's just the switch and the power cord and the manual which I already put aside. It should be plug and play, so I will just hook up the network cables, but before I do that I will do a quick speed test with my old switch, so you can see the difference between them. So I'm on my desktop right now and will just use the standard speed test on google.com. Right now you see the results of my old TP-Link 5 port fast Ethernet switch, that's the TL-SF1005D, which costs around $10 on Amazon. And you can see I don't even reach the 100 Mbits, so it's around 74 actually. But the upload is pretty decent, almost reaching the 50 Mbits from my contract. Alright, and I will now quickly unplug the old switch and plug in the new one. I did that on the fly, it's working immediately and as you can see the result speaks for itself. I'm getting even a bit more than 250 Mbits and also the upload reaches the 50 Mbits. The TP-Link TL-SG1005D is available on Amazon for around $17, but for me it's absolutely worth the upgrade, easy to install and does a decent job so far. If I will notice any problems in the next couple of weeks with the switch, I will pin a comment and I will also post all the links in the comment box below, so you can check them out on Amazon. If this video helped you or you liked what you've seen, leave a thumbs up and hit the subscribe and bell button to get notified about all my upcoming videos here on my channel. Thanks everyone for watching and see you next time.